Okay, so I'm at Joan Soba's house on Gaylor Avenue. Um, I'm at 124 feet, and this is as far as I can get. I'm in 6 inch sewer line, concrete sewer line, and the sewer line looks good for the most part. Um, probably 10 feet from the main, and this is as far as my camera will reach. I'm going to pull back. As you can see, there's a hole in the pipe at 97 feet. It's a pretty massive hole. Another crack in the bell of the pipe at 88 feet. And we have Y's coming in. Now we're in cast iron entering the house. Cast iron is rippled and folding on the bottom, broken in many sections, and leaking, there's cracks all along the bottom of the pipe, the pipe is pushed up in a bunch of areas, right there, Making a turn. Cast iron is been broken due to ground movement. I'm assuming there's a Y at seventy nine feet for adjacent drain line. It's holding water. Any small breaks and holes in the pipe. Pipe other than the breaks looks like it's in good condition, not a lot of wear. And for the age of the pipe, it should not be in the condition that it is from normal usage. See, there we have a protrusion in the pipe where it has curled up. For some reason, something is pressed up underneath it. More damage to the cast iron. Pipe is holding water.
Sections where the pipe have been pushed up, causing it to lose grade. Again, being pushed up on the bottom of the pipe, creating a mound that creates water to settle behind it. Y at 53 feet. Lots of cast iron flakes and sediment in the bottom of the pipe along with irregular indents. We have rocks and debris in pipe. That is very damaged. been pushed up in that section and broken. Large rock in the pipe. As you can see the cast iron has been damaged. Y at 34 feet. Cast iron is torn. Looks like it's been protruded from the bottom outside of the pipe, pushing in to the pipe, piercing the pipe. A major protrusion right there. Cast iron. Looks like the pipe has been pushed up.
using the clean out. 